Lisa and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be doing a small Dollarama haul. If you happen to be in the part of the world like I am that doesn't have a Target Dollar Spot, a Dollar General, or a Dollar Tree, I thought I would do a Dollarama haul and show you what household items, snacks, grocery items you can get for 20 Canadian dollars and how that compares to the pricing at say your local Atlantic Superstore. Um, so let's get to our haul. I'm first going to show you all of the items that I got in my haul and then we'll kind of go over what the pricing was at Dollarama versus the Atlantic Superstore. So we're first going to start off with these chewy granola bars. They are a 120 gram box and they have <laughs> my cats in the background racing around. They always want to uh, be included in the video somehow and they include five granola bars. Then I also have some Minute Maid and Five Alive one liter juice container. I also got a can of Manwich, a 680ml can of Hunt's original pasta sauce, some Sultana raisins, 225 gram bag, some instant basmati rice. Now this pouch is 150 grams and it's already pre-cooked. We also got some smoked oysters and some smoked mussels. They are an 85 gram tin. We also got some rice cakes. They are chocolate covered rice cakes. Now all of these items are also um, gluten and dairy free except for this one the chocolate does have some milk in the milk chocolate but everything else is gluten and dairy free we also got some Tostitos rounds a 250 gram bag as well as some Clark's baked beans and a big bag of peanuts in the shell so all of these items are, as you can see, are snack or cooking household items. Um, I know our grocery bills are astronomical and um, I happened to look, I happened to go into our superstore today and one little container of gluten-free Oreos is now 10 Canadian dollars. So if you can make all of your own goodies then why wouldn't you because pricing is insane off the charts so now let's see how much all of the, the all of these items cost 20 Canadian dollars now let's kind of go over the sizes and the pricing that would be at your local superstore so let's start first with the basmati rice. It's a 150 gram packet and it is $1. Now this is comparable at the superstore for $2.88, $2.88 for a 150 gram bag. Then we'll go on to the delicious Sultana raisins. Great in recipes, great just as a snack and so delicious. So the Sultana raisins were $1.25, as you can see here, and comparable at the superstore was four Canadian dollars for the same size packet of raisins. And then we have our Manwich sauce, and yes, for those of you that may not know, Manwich is gluten dairy free. Um, I guess most of you would know that, but if you don't and you like Sloppy Joes and you like making things that involve a manwich sauce yeah it's gluten and dairy free so this was a dollar fifty a dollar seventy five at our local dollarama and it is two ninety nine at the superstore now i forget what i've gone over and what i haven't gone over um then we've got our quaker five bars 120 grams um s'mores granola bars now this was two dollars a box and at the local superstore, they are $3.49. Then we're gonna go on to our delicious chocolate dipped rice cakes. These were $1.50, they are a six count, and these rice cakes, comparable pricing is $4.99 to $5.99, is what I could find comparable online. Now I will pop some pictures up of things now, because these 
weren't available at the superstore, so I just happened to search online and see how much they were um, for a 90 gram six count package. And then these delicious peanuts in the shell, a 400 gram bag was $2.25 at the dollar store and is comparable peanuts in the shell two dollars and sixty cents for a 400 gram bag so not a huge savings there for peanuts in the shell but still saving 35 cents per bag um so as well as we've got our tostitos rounds 250 gram bag they are three dollars and 25 cents at our local dollarama and at our local superstore they are anywhere from $3.99 to $5.99. So I averaged that out to be $4.65. So you're saving about $1.40. So all of these items, oh, and then we have our Minute Maid and Five Alive juices. Now for a one, these are one liter each. And the only thing that was comparable at the Superstore was uh, 1.75 liters. So these together were $2.00. Hey, you guys they were two dollars for two liters so and 3.99 for 1.5 1.75 liters at the superstore so definitely worth it to stock up on your juices as well as their pantry or like shelf stable so those are Let's not forget about baking soda. One thing about having cats or doing a lot of baking, baking soda definitely comes in handy when changing your litters or um, deodorizing. It's easy, even really great for deodorizing or adding to your laundry as well. So this box of baking soda was $1.50 and the comparable at our local Canadian superstore was $2.29. So, Adding all of those things up, they total 20 Canadian dollars. And if you add up all of the pricing at the local superstore, it came to $37.08. So almost half the price by going to your local Dollarama and stocking up on these household items, baking items, household items, snacks. So if you are feeling the pinch and are struggling to be able to afford groceries, um, be sure to check out your local Dollarama. They have some great finds. I will have to also go over like all of the things that are available that are gluten and dairy free. Now, like I said, all of these are free of your food allergens, so you should be safe in consuming them if you happen to have any allergy issues. So yeah, I mean, I hope you found this review and this little Dollarama haul um, helpful um, in when you're trying to penny pinch and afford all of your groceries during this time of inflation. And uh, if you found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and while you're at it, hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload new videos. And let me know if you like seeing some of these videos where I go over hauls and pricing and how to make your dollar stretch. So yeah, thanks for hanging out everyone. I'll see you again soon friends. Bye bye!